Hey, welcome to the show. Today we have a division problem. We have a four digit number divided by a one digit number. Um, if you like this, make sure you check out my other videos and I'd sure appreciate it if you hit that likey button down below and that subscribe button, that means the world to me. All right, let's go ahead and get started here. So first of all, there are four steps when you are dividing. You have divide, multiply, subtract, and bring it down. I'm gonna walk you through each of these steps. All right, let's get started here. Put the pen tool on and I'm going to make this problem just a little bit smaller to work with. And I'm going to kind of scale that down just a little bit there so we can all see that. Okay, now we start. Can I put four into three? You can't, can you? It's Three is too small. So we need to work with the next number and that would be 38. How many times can I put four into 38? So it's always good to know your multiplication. So nine times four would be 36. 10 times 4 would be 40, so we're going to stick with 9, 9 times 4. So I'm going to go ahead and put the 9 right here, and my next step is to multiply. So I'm going to take 9 times 4, which is 36, and then put the 36 right here, and then we're all ready for the next step, and that is subtraction. So let's go ahead and subtract. 8 minus 6, what is 8 minus 6? 2! And then... 3 minus 3 is 0. Don't even need to put anything right there. And our next step is to bring the next number down. And the next number would be 6. Just going to drop it down. Just drop it all the way down here and put it right there. All right. So what do we do now? We're going to start the whole process over. So right now I'm going to go ahead and select this. I'm going to make this a little bit smaller to work with. If you're doing good so far, hit that like button. Let me know how you're doing. Yeah. And I hope you're out there having a beautiful day. All right, let's start the whole process over. How many times can I put 4 into 26? 4 times 3, 12. 4 times 4, 16. 4 times 5, 25. 4 times 6, 24. 4 times 7, 28. Too big. We're going to stay with 4 times 6. So I'm going to go ahead and put the 6 right here. All right, now the next step is to multiply. So 6 times 4 equals... 24, yeah, and so I'm going to put 24 right here, and then I'm going to go ahead and then do the next one is uh, subtraction. So 6 times, uh, 6 minus 4 equals 2, and then our next step is to bring it down. I'm going to bring that next number down, which is a 5, just drop that all the way down here, and then put 5 here, and that's, that's it, and now we just start the whole process over. Divide. How many times can I put 4 into 25? Again, I think it's going to be 6. I know it's going to be 6. So I'm going to put 6 right here. And then 6 times 4 is 24. Next step is to subtract. And we are left with a 1. Do we have any other numbers to drop down? No. And so this number right here is going to be our remainder. So I'm going to put a little r right here and then put the 1. So we have a remainder. So our answer is 966 with a remainder of 1. Wasn't that cool? Hey, thanks a lot for watching this show. Make sure you check out my other channel. I have another channel devoted to um, mathematics. I also have another channel to dinosaurs and math. Check out down below in the comments there. I'd love to read your comments if you have any special requests. And again, if you could hit that likey button, just hit that likey button. That lets me know that you like the show. Helps me out too. Hey, I hope you're having a great day out there. Go for a walk. Uh, you know, fly a kite. Um, you know, do some jogging. Play some soccer. Get out and enjoy the day. I hope you're doing great. Talk to you later. Adios. Goodbye.